Happy Wednesday. Thanks for clicking to WYTV.com. I'm meteorologist Ryan Halicki. This is a look at our next storm system that brings some wet weather to start your Thursday, but I don't think there is too much to complain about. I know we've had a lot of rain, but hey, at least we're going to see our reward for those cold temperatures earlier this week starting to move in. This storm system will help pool in some warmer air for us. We'll have that batch of showers and also some blustery or breezy winds as we go into the day Thursday. I do expect winds picking up potential there for gusts in that 30 to 40 mile per hour range at times as we see the clouds thin out for the second half of the day. That's something we'll be keeping an eye on. So here's how this is all going to play out for us as we go through our Wednesday evening. Clouds will be on the increase. We're already seeing that here and by morning rain chances coming up. I do expect to see showers around during the start of our day as we go through Thursday's morning commute. Well, while you're likely to be running those windshield wipers heading into the afternoon, showers will start to taper off as that storm system exits. Now, doesn't mean we won't have a few raindrops around, at least for the very early afternoon, but the trend will be for showers to taper and these clouds to start thinning out. Now, I do expect to at least see a little bit of that milky sunshine as we get the uh, clouds starting to thin. If we can break enough of these and get to that full sun before sunset, we do have a chance at temps uh, going a little warmer than what I'm looking at for highs. I'm going with a uh, lower to near mid 60s, but I wouldn't be surprised if we get into full sun to get up to upper 60s in some spots there. So it will be a warmer day overall by Thursday night. Clouds continue to clear. Nice night, quiet and dry. We'll drop down toward the lower 40s for uh, morning lows on our Friday. Now much of the day Friday will be dry. We'll look for some sun and temps. They jump back into the 60s. Second half of the day though, there is a small chance for a couple of raindrops around, especially as we get into Friday evening. That's where we'll be watching another push of even warmer warmer air working into the region. So this is a stop at 5 a.m. Saturday on long range future cast. A warm front will be pushing through and that will be accompanied by a chance for some showers early on our Saturday. Second half of the day, we're sitting in this warm sector and we're talking a, a brief brush with summer here as we go through the weekend. Finally, our reward after four straight weekends of temperatures turning colder, not this weekend. Warm temps through the weekend into early next week, but don't put away the coats just yet. There will be another drop in temperatures. You're going to see that here in the seven day outlook. So rain a little elevated on our hassle factors list. 44 degrees for our low. We'll see showers developing late tonight. So by daybreak, I do expect rain chances uh, becoming much more likely here with wet weather around during that morning commute into the afternoon showers taper. And then we look for skies to become partly sunny 63 for that high and it will be a little breezy out there, but a hey, no complaint 60s better than temps in the 30s. We'll take that breeze now for Friday mid 60s. Partly sunny and again, second half of the day, there is a chance for a few raindrops around. Same goes for very early in the day on Saturday. As we get into the late morning, though, rain chance is coming down and we get that warm push of air coming in, taking us all the way to the upper 70s and highs around 80 on Sunday. Great looking weather to spend some time outdoors this weekend. Take it in. Enjoy these temperatures. We'll still be warm on Monday, but second half of the day, I am watching a cold front that comes through that comes with some showers, some thunderstorms, another push of colder air. Highs fall back toward the low 50s here as we get to Monday, and we'll see a mostly cloudy sky. Rain chances lower Monday than they're looking for, or excuse me, lower Tuesday than they're looking for Wednesday. Wednesday, we're looking at that chance for showers, but Notice that low temperature. I would not be surprised to see again a couple of snowflakes during the colder parts of the day, cloudy and chilly with highs in the mid 40s.